Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. You are an American, are you not? Last time I checked. Oh, thank God, sir. Thank God. I have had it up to here with Dagos, up to here. A savages. Well, I do what I can to help. But this land was imagined by an angry god for an angry people. <laughs> Well, America ain't exactly a peaceful paradise, mister. Well, um, I tried, but well, at least you lot try to speak bloody English. Uh, this bloody lot? My God, if I'd wanted to speak Spanish, I'd have gone to Spain. Why didn't you? Oh, good question. Well, you know, business, I suppose. Devil making work for idle hands, what? <laughs> now, uh, now, listen, friend. If you were to go west to Nosa Lida, I'd give you a reward for picking up a package of mine from the docks. Hmm? Well, there's, there's some fighting broken out there. Uh, it seems like it's more your kind of thing. Why would I want to do something like that? <laughs> oh, you Americans are all the same, obsessed with bloody money. Well, I will pay you, sir. I will give you a buck. Names Tollitz, sir. Uriah Tollitz. They'll know of me in Nosa Lida. How much? Plenty, sir, plenty. Uh, now you will take it and give it to the foreman of the estate at El Matadoro. He'll be expecting it. <laughs> Try to give those dagos hell, what? <laughs> oh, that's a fine fellow. Gracias. You're a friend to Mexico. Here's a little money, a sign of my gratitude. Now we must leave. Are you the foreman, mister? I got a package for you from a Mr. Tollix. Oh, thank you so much, my friend. What was the delay? Trouble over in Nasalita. Army or rebels? <laughs> Politics, my friend, is for fools. Which is why we see so much of it down here. Land of morons. Gets in the way of real work? If you say so. Here's the money for Mr. Dalitz. I'll get this to the workers right away. That's quite a sum. <laughs> Must be valuable stuff. You have no idea, Gringo. No idea. 
If you would have known, you would have kept it all yourself. Mr. Tollitz, I've got your money. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you. I damn well knew you were the kind of chap to be trusted. A fine fellow, sir. Fine fellow indeed. Unlikely to run off and report me to the authorities, what? <laughs> report what, Tollitz? Well, the Dagos here don't appreciate the terrible needs we answer. Well, building a country's hard, sir. It's hard. Our opium's nasty business, but it's necessary. Necessary. Opium? What do you mean you didn't even sneak a taste of that package? <laughs> Are you mad, sir? That's fine stuff. Straight from Ongo Bongo land somewhere. <laughs> you use me. Are you a moralist or just a fool? Both, I guess. We provide a much-needed service for the railroad workers. We help ease the pain and loneliness, them being so far away from home and all that. <laughs> but there's nothing wrong with this. I've smoked it myself for years. Here. I don't want nothing to do with it. Well, I thank you. Here's hoping we can do business again in the future. Beats dealing with the bloody savages. If I'm not mistaken, our business is done here. Is there something else I can do for you? Well, be off then. You're making the place look untidy. Really? See, si. hola. Bloody Americans. Hola. Hello, friend. Hola, senor. <laughs> 